guys, so I am about to attempt a blackhead removal toning type thing here from Aprilis. Um, here's the box for it <clears throat> so that you can see what it looks like. But I am going to show you how it works and I'm going to put it on, but I'm not going to show you how to take it off because I've done these black, um, blackhead removal charcoal mask type things before the peel off masks and it's painful and I'm not about to put myself through that on camera. I'll put my kids through that on camera, but not me. Um, so in this kit, you get three different products. You get the um, exfoliant, you get the mask, get over here on the camera, the mask, and then you get the toner to use afterwards. Um, it says start off, wash your face. I've got hair pulled back because I just washed the face. So I've got a clean face ready to start. And so first step, all of your instructions are on the back of the box. Um, do not rely on the backs of the products to tell you what to do because the back of the exfoliant that it says to use first after washing your face says to apply once or daily, once or twice daily after cleansing and toning. Well, I'm applying it after cleansing, but um, I'm not going to be doing this every day with this mask. Babble, babble over there. So I am, I got my cotton pad here. I'm going to put some of this exfoliant on the pad so that I can get my face all toned up beforehand. It says five to 10 minutes on this. So obviously I'm not going to be doing this long enough to um, really let it set in. But um, because I don't want to have you here for like 20 minutes on a video, but get this all over the face. That should be nice and fresh and clean from washing. Um, I don't know if this is like the um, typical um, glycolic acid types of peels where it's going to exfoliate. Boy, I'm getting blurry on the camera there because I'm moving. Um, I don't know if it will do like the, the hydraulic hydro hydrolonic acid um peels on you um i'm hoping not i'm hoping that this is just giving me a good um base for putting the mask on so that it doesn't hurt as much when i pull it off um okay so i got that on like i said it says on the box to um well actually all it says on the box is apply a cotton pad with several drops of skin exfoliant um but it does say on here five to ten minutes on that little that little one right up there. So I'm trying to let it dry a little bit before I put the other stuff on. Okay, pull my sleeves up so that I don't make a mess. Okay. Um, the back of this one, wash your face with warm water. Put a hot towel on the face a few minutes to open your pores. You want your pores open, obviously, which I have not done. I mean, I washed and then I've done that, but... Um, my skin is probably already, come on camera, get, not be so blurry, woo, get back up here. Um, my face is probably, the pores have probably closed up a little bit since then. Oh, you're fine, you stop that. And of course she's going to be like that. Apply a thick, even layer on the oily parts of your face, like the nose, the forehead, the chin, and the cheeks. Avoid the eye area, your eyebrows, you got hair there. Um, the hairline and lips, so you don't want to pull all the hair off. So here we go. After I pull the little cap off the inside. Because right now, nothing's coming out. Actually, it's trying to come out because I squeeze so hard. Don't want to waste it, right? Okay. So see if I can get this stupid little foil piece off as I get more on me. Ha ha, success. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, so I'll put the lid back on it so I squeeze it the right way. Cute, aren't I? Mm -hmm. All right, so here we go. Okay, so and then I'm not going to keep you here long after that. I'm going to just right across the nose and the cheeks. It says apply thick. Obviously, that's not thick. That would be thick right there. Um, oh, what is mom doing? Hey. So yeah, it's going to take some time painting my face. Hey. Mm. hey. And I'm going to look lovely for about hey. 20 minutes because it says to leave it on 20 minutes on the back of the box. Hey. 
But you get the general idea. I'm not going to sit here and paint continuously right now. I'll take a picture of myself and I'll have that on the, the written review. So if you want to check out that written review and see how it worked for me and if it was as painful as I was afraid it would be, uh, make sure you check out that link in the description below. Make sure that you um, like my page so that you can come back and see other crazy things later. Maybe I might actually be brave enough and do another video of me trying to peel it off. Huh, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Um, Depends on how adventurous I feel and how much she's screaming in the background since I'm trying to do this before nap time. Um, but yeah, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, drop those comments down below if you have any tips and tricks for how to do this in the most non-painful manner possible. Um, and yeah, I'll leave it at that. So um, when you're done, oh, I'm going to keep gooping myself up here in a minute. When you're done... This stuff is a heaven sin because, like I said, it hurts when you pull it off. Um, you can do a search on YouTube and see other people doing it. And, yeah, you want to be able to soothe afterwards because you need to. So, I am going to go ahead and stop it from here. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure you come back again soon. And until then, bye.